Let's talk about linden flowers. Really great for sleep and stress and high blood pressure and all kinds of different things, even pain and arthritis, all kinds of problems. And I find it very, very safe. Dr. Paul Hader, Master Herbalist, get healthy now. Hi, Dr. Paul Hader, Master Herbalist here. Well, I want to talk about linden flower leaves and tea and the uh, uh, flowers themselves and the really great for making tea and also you can get it in capsules and lotions and all kinds of different things really great for all kinds of different problems but before we get into that if you like what i do please give me a thumbs up also please subscribe also please tell others also please watch those little ads at the beginning they bring a few cents towards us and i appreciate that in a great great way it makes a difference in our life also please get a copy of my new book Live a cancer-free life. You know, more than half of you are going to come down with cancer. And I'll, and I'll say a majority are going to die from it, which is not good. What well, save your life? It, you know, I have a five-star rating on Amazon with this book, and it's a real short read. A few things that you can do to change your life and not come down with cancer. It's easier to prevent than it is to actually treat and overcome. And uh, this is not a hard thing to do. Just Google, live a cancer-free life, and it will come up on my name. It'll take you directly to it. And I don't want you to come down with cancer, cancer that's for sure. Well, linden flowers are just great stuff. There's no doubt about it. I happen to have the, the bulk one right there. Also, the linden flower, this is a particular Spanish brand. It grows all over the world. It's great for a lot of different problems, sleep, stress, lowering blood pressure, helps with inflammation, helps with pain, bronchitis, asthma, weight loss, colds and flus, and boosting up your immune system, on and on and on. And in used in moderation, there's absolutely no side effects. I've never seen in my 30 years any problems with using it whatsoever. And it really is great stuff. It grows all over the world. There's about four different species the uh, Latin name species is Tila. That's why this says Tila on the front. <laughs> Tila. And uh, it grows in Europe. It grows in the United States. Uh, very common in the UK. It also grows in Canada. Also in Mexico. Very common. They have their own species there too. In Central America too. Not sure if it's in South America. But it uh, doesn't grow here in the Caribbean. But really a common thing you probably have it growing on your city streets and you probably don't know it and uh, if it's not sprayed you can make some tea with this you may have it in your backyard and you don't even know it it's really great grows to about four, 90 feet tall it's a huge tree and i highly recommend you know growing this tree because it, you know it can help in a great way the leaves can be used the flowers can be used the stems can be used and also the wood uh, if you happen to cut off a couple limbs because you know you have to prune your trees that can be burned and made into activated charcoal also so it's a multi-purpose tree and it's a very pretty tree also and the smell of the tea is just like chamomile i i find it almost indistinguishable it's very very wonderful and it's a great sleep aid i'm telling you a wonderful sleep aid and helps with people suffering insomnia jangled nerves and anxiety in general i highly recommend it uh actually uh, this wonderful tea has been shown to actually depress the central nervous system so you kind of give you a sedating effect so you fall asleep and also it has a strong another study showed it had strong sedative effects so if you're suffering from you know insomnia or just can't sleep or you wake up in the middle of the night and you can't sleep you want to take some wonderful tila or linda flower tea. Really great. Also contains a lot of amino acids, which are great. Alanine, cysteine, uh, isolutine, leucine, theonalanine, all kinds of serine. Lots of wonderful um, amino acids, which are great for the body. And very few of those, you know, these type of things have uh, proteins like that. Also lowers blood pressure. I uh, highly recommend it. Uh, really great. If you ha happen to suffer from a terrible high blood pressure, you know, blood pressure is the next step towards having kidney disease. 
uh, high blood pressure is, and also having a stroke. So you want to get rid of that. That's for sure. And uh, if you want to get a do a consultation with me at 831-869-9119, you won't have to take anything, and we'll get your blood pressure under control. 831-869-9119. Also, a lot of studies showing it has a lot of uh, pedicides, rutocides, chlorogenics, acid, all kinds of things which lower blood pressure in general. So it really does work. There's no doubt about it. Contains a huge amount of antioxidants. Uh, also, there's bilinin, tocopherols, quercetin, uh, hesperitin, eugenol. Uh, all kinds of different things. Another 14 different antioxidants in there, a huge amount of antioxidants. Soothes the way stress, and everybody's got stress these days. I mean, if you don't have stress, you know, hold your hand up because you're one of the few. <laughs> People have stress like it's going out of style like right now, and I get it all the time. And so, if you're taking a little bit of this tea or taking the capsules or you know, using some of the lotion on yourself, it, you'll get rid of your stress and you'll feel more relaxed and your nerves will go down. And it also creates a particular uh, string of proteins, a actual chemical, which is similar to GABA in the brain. So it's very soothing to the brain. So it helps you to relax. So it's very important. Also, it's anti-inflammatory. So Wow, what more can you ask for? It helps to get really, especially for the liver and the gallbladder. So that's really great. If you have inflamed liver or gallbladder, I think it's really important to take some linden flower tea or capsules or even the tincture. You can find it all kinds of ways. Also helps with pain. Anything that has a huge amount of antioxidants in it helps with pain. So redness, swelling, and pain will help to make that go away. And especially helps with arthritis also. Great for the lungs. Great for bronchitis. Great for asthma because of all those antioxidants also. And helps to open up the, the uh, bronchi. And also opens up the blood vessels too. But that's how it actually lowers blood pressure. Also helps with mucus and phlegm. So if you're suffering from mucus and phlegm, you want to take some linden flower tea or capsules. It really does a great job. It's an antispasmatic also for the lungs and really good for that too. It's a natural diuretic. If you've got a few extra water weight pounds on you, <laughs> you want to get rid of. You might want to take some linden flower tea or some capsules. And also helps to get some mucus out and detox your body in general, which is really great. Uh, also, it helps with digestion problems. And there was a study done with children with uh, antibiotic-resistant diarrhea, and they put them on uh, linden flower tea, and lo and behold, they got rid of it. So it really does a great job uh, with the digestive problems in general. Also helps with weight loss. I don't know how it helps with weight loss. I think a lot of people it works with because they have a lot of anxiety and we eat because of anxiety. We eat because of stress. How many people eat because they're hungry? <laughs> Not too many. <laughs> we eat because of all these other things. And also habit. What's another thing that we eat? You know, why, why reason that we eat? We eat because out of habit. You know, we're not really hungry. Just eat, eat, eating, eating, eating. So I find that uh, taking a little linden flower tea can help with that in a great way also. Also helps with migraine headaches and headaches in general because it helps with tension. And that's really great for that. Uh, also helps with fatigue. Uh, I find it in small doses it helps with fatigue in general. I think it's really great and help because it helps you to relax because when you can relax you have more energy in general also like i said it's good for the gi tract also helps with heartburn and gas and a lower stomach acid too also you can burn the wood and make activated charcoal which is good for gas also good for cellulitis and edema intestinal problems in general also it helps with colds and flus because it has lots of antioxidants and helps to keep away colds and flus and other irritations. So I think that's really important, especially now. And uh, I think it's really great. Also helps with sore throats and uh, red mucous membranes and reduces fevers, 
and helps with coughs and other flu type complaints and cold type complaints. It helps in general, so I highly recommend it. Also, studies showing that it helps with kids with ear, ear infections, so I highly recommend it. Uh, you know, that's a, a monster right there, and a lot of people are finding this. You know, every child has ear, ear infections, but a lot of this has to do with all the chemicals in our food. Not good. Also, you can make a wonderful uh, balm for the skin. You can actually take a, a, a wet cloth, a, a washcloth, and actually pour the tea on there and put it on your face and it helps to get rid of uh, irritated skin, puffy eyes and swelling and rashes, all kinds of things. And it feels so good and smells so good too. Really a great way to go. So just, you know, take it. Take the tea, which is cool, put it on a, a washcloth, put it on your face. You might want to put it also in the, in the fridge for a while and then put it on your face. Really great. Also, soothing as a bath. <clears throat> you can put it into your bath. You know, take about four tablespoons of the leaves or flowers and put it in your bath, a nice hot bath, and that helps with tension and stress and everything also. Because kind of, you know, this is our biggest organ on the outside of our body, which is a, the skin, and it'll just absorb right through your skin. Really great. Uh, like I said, it helps with tension and helps with preventing colds. If you want to make tea, take a, uh, a really nice heaping teaspoon of the flowers themselves or the leaves and a combination of both. Or you can get it in tea bags like this. This is tea bags. And uh, put that in a cup. Add some hot water, let it steep for 15 minutes, and drink that three or four times a day, and that really will do a great job. Uh, you can find it at teas and capsules and lotions and creams and tinctures. Uh, yeah, I would take the tea up to three to four times a day. Also, the capsules, 250 milligrams, three, four times a day will work also. Tinctures, four milliliters. Uh, up to three times a day will work also. And you can find it on Amazon and eBay, your health food store, just about everywhere. I even found this at a local grocery store. So just about anywhere you will have it. And this I found for about 10 tea bags for only 99 cents. Wow, really great stuff. This comes from Spain. They have a lot of uh, uh, little teas that they make there. Also, you know, it's great to have in your medicine cabinet. I think it's really important to have some of these things in your medicine cabinet all the time. As far as side effects go, if you take it three, four times a day, absolutely no problem whatsoever. Over my 30-year period of being an herbalist, I've never really seen any kind of a side effect. But anybody can have an allergic reaction. I don't recommend it for those who are pregnant, nursing, or small children. But, uh, you know, in general, it's very, very safe. They say it might interact with some medications, and if I don't recommend taking it if you're driving or, you know, driving a machine, using machinery or something like that. And so, also, you trade off with valerian and passion flower. That would make it really important to trade off once in a while. Also, in the UK, they make uh, linden flower cordials. They take a, like a pound of the flowers itself. I don't get into sugar very much, but they take a pound of sugar also <laughs> and mix that together, add a little bit of water and let that set for a, a few hours until all the goodness of the flowers comes out into the sugar itself. And they add, add a little more water and they freeze it into ice cubes to use for drinks. Very relaxing in the afternoon. You could use it in replace of uh, chamomile tea. So that's another thing to think about. If you want to do a consultation, please do. If we can get rid of your chronic disease at 831-869-9119. 831-869-9119. And have a wonderful day. You know, remember to smile. That's your invitation to, you know, open up and uh, create a new friend in your life. So allow yourself to smile and say hello to a lot of people. It's important. Remember God and remember, I love you.